Hi, I'm Heather McCullough. Welcome to Kids Club. Kim, why is it important to get our kids involved in visual arts? Well, it's a big uh, component in the kindergarten program especially. It's a great way to have the kids express themselves. A lot of kids aren't always good at pencil paper tasks, mm -hmm. so it meets a lot of different uh, learning styles. So what kinds of things do you have them doing then? Uh, well, the arts are woven into everything that we do. Mm -hmm. So I might do a math art activity. I might do, so it might be counting snowballs. Or okay. I would do a, a math reading activity where we read a book and they respond to it visually. Writing, they're always doing some sort of writing and, and responding to it with a picture that goes along with it. Just another way that they get to express themselves. Okay. Now, are we still teaching kids to, you know, color in the lines or out of no. the lines or what? what? No, we're not doing that anymore. <laughs> Kindergarten is definitely changing, mm -hmm. uh, especially with the full day learning coming mm -hmm. next year. Um, the kids are definitely in a new way of thinking, and so are the parents. Okay. It's sort of about educating them too. They tend to parents tend to like, you know, those those uh, crafts that you bring home, mm -hmm. like a turkey for your Thanksgiving table right. or. Uh, <laughs> you know, a snowman in the mm -hmm. winter, and we do do that. There is a place for that, yes. but it's more of an inquiry-based learning visually and uh, the process. It, it might not be done in one day. So what? So let's say it's Thanksgiving and you're not doing a turkey, then right. what? how would you be engaging them visually at that? We might read a book about it. They okay. might create their own book about it oh, okay. and write what they think about the turkey. So it hits on a lot of when you're learning letters and sounds mm -hmm. and instead of just creating a turkey that looks like everybody else's turkey right and it's all cut out it's their own creation their own creation yeah, yeah something they're proud of not just the cookie cutter stuff color that's it right. in instead of no. okay no, that sounds none good of that. now how does it transfer as they get older what, what how does that curriculum sort of carry through to the older grades well i really find a lot of teachers get stuck with on friday period five mm -hmm. we are going to have our art time okay. and it, it does not have to work that way. The arts can be, you know, woven through math and science, reading, and I think you get better results too. So what are the kids learning? How does this change them as they explore sort of these different elements? Well, I think it makes them think about themselves more mm -hmm. as artists. They're looking at things with different points of view. Mm -hmm. They're uh, respecting what each other are creating mm. and learning from each other that way. Now how can parents supplement this at home? How can they get their kids a little bit more engaged in some of the visual arts? They can take them to a local theater. Mm -hmm. I think that's a great way. There's lots of plays that are going on. Okay. Um, they can enroll them in an art class. Okay. At a lot of places in Peterborough especially they have really great art programs even from really young up. And I think most of all, though, it's important is that they're working with them, working with the kids. Even if it's a scrap piece of paper and a pen, right. it doesn't have to be anything elaborate. They're talking about it. They're working through it. So they're able to embrace it more. I don't think my kids won't be helping them with their art. No, I can't will. draw a straight line, but that's okay. <laughs> great, great tips. So get your kids involved in, in visual arts. Encourage them to be expressive in their own way. Yeah. That's what we're saying? Awesome. Yeah. This has been the Kids Club. I'm Heather McCullough, and we'll see you again next time. Kids Club is brought to you by the Boys and Girls Clubs of Kawartha Lakes, a good place to be. For more information, visit bgckl.com.